Hello, everybody. I wanted to share with you my little desk setup here. It is really cute, isn't it? It's a worky station. And it's like a briefcase slash work desk area. Has like a has like a you know dry erase board and a place to put your laptop or iPad, a place to put um, your power cable, plug in your power cable, charge your items, put in a slot to put in your um, either folders or paperwork that you're working on. This is like a eight and a half by 11 or maybe more than that. So you could put papers or, you know, your mouse pad and what, whatever you want to put in there. So what I, um, what I really love about this is that it has a light here. Look at that. It has two settings. So bright and then a little bit dimmer. It, this is, um, a metallic dry erase board. Uh, so I put these cute little Disney magnets here that I got from Disneyland. Aren't they cute? Um, I did have to use my own eraser, so uh, this one's magnetic, so it just kind of like sticks onto that surface there. It does not have any pens, and I guess this is where you could prop up your phone and your iPad if you if you're working on you know other things if you want to watch YouTube. But I love the LED lights because it just kind of makes your face more illuminated when you're like Zoom calling or doing a FaceTime or whatever on your computer, or even like I can use it for, you know, doing like photo shoot right here, cover this up with whiteboard and do a photo shoot. And that's my light right there. I really love that. It doesn't come with any pens. So I bought these pens. They're so cute. Um, they're a little bit larger. And I noticed that there's four slots here. So these four big uh, dry erase, markers uh, fit perfectly in there and there's four different colors and again this is for your phone and then your um, ipad this locks it in so it won't crash down on you or close on you there's a um i guess you could put your headphones or whatever your earbuds or wired i i do have headphones 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 but um they're over there by the other big computer or, you know, whatever you want to put up there. Um, a hat. <laughs> Anyways, I love this this because, again, uh, you have little slots here. Uh, this is plastic, and I like to put my charging cable here. And, again, you can charge or power up your um, laptop or charge your phone. Oops. Um uh, this has a little rubber band or elastic band to hold your laptop in place when you are um, closing it and moving it around. Uh, this is my matching uh, mouse pad. And then in here you could put all your paperwork that you're working on and store it in there. Um, this is where you could put your pens and markers and Apple pen and pencils and erasers and all that. So I just love how it basically is like when you're done using it, you can turn off the light and then close it off. Oops, I got to unlock it here because that's the safety thing. Close it off and you can hide whatever you <laughs> your mess is on your desk. But obviously I have, you know, I'm not minimalist. I'm a maximalist. So those are all my mess back there. But if I open this up. You can see that it's all hidden here. Just It's more for like, you know, just organization. It's just a really cool aesthetic, futuristic way of working remotely or, you know, if you want to bring your office to wherever you're at and keep it all together. Also, I got this little Rolodex document holder here on Amazon, and I love that it's like a baby blue. I, I thought it was teal, but it's actually like a... a, a you know, baby blue. So um, I love that I can just reference things really quick. It's on Amazon. It costs about $99. Yeah, I was looking for something like this in most of them, the document holders like this, a desktop holder. Uh, these are very expensive. So this one was pretty decent price and it was $10 less. So I 
you know, jumped on it and I got it. So what it is is just a plastic, um, uh, you know, just a frame. And you could put in your documents in here if you want to reference them really quick instead of just, you know, getting your uh, documents in a folder. It's all here very fast, very quick. You could get it. This here I have my T-shirt prices that, that I'm um, looking to price for my website and more private information there i'm not going to share that but um i just love how it references everything uh for example you know just basically how to organize everything you know all in one little rolodex here it's just great so that's that and i'm also going to unbox something i got today and through Amazon, and I ordered this, like, literally this morning. And I got it at, like, maybe 12 o'clock, because it was sitting there when I got home from um, a store, because I was returning an Amazon purchase. So let me prop you up here. Let's see if I could do this correctly. All right, great. And let me open it first, because I don't want to bore you with the wrapping and all that but um it was about sixty dollars and normally they're like 80 something but um yeah it cost me about 68 dollars 70 dollars and it's called the ok cam i really love it because it's small and look how small it is in the box and it's a document cam for Students or teachers, remember when we did remote learning when the pandemic started and basically everybody was at home learning. And so as, you know, an online teacher, because I am, um, and also, you know, just to share with you different items on YouTube and unboxing, I felt like this is a really way, good way to go showing you on a document cam. So I guess this is about, was it like eight megapixels or something like that? Or 1080p or something like that? I'm not sure. I gotta look in the instructions, but uh, let's see. Uh, there, It's really small. Look how small this is. Oh my God, this is, okay, let's get rid of this. This is one of those little, so that you, don't have a lot of humidity in there, so let's get rid of that. Okay, here's the USB. Okay. I guess it's plug and play. So let's test it out. Well, on my little computer here, I know it's charged. And um, let's test this out. Whoops. Sorry about that. Okay, here we go. I'm going to turn this sucker on. And then I have multiple ports on here but um i'm gonna use it on this area because this worky station is just perfect for my oops my right handedness okay so i'm going to flip these things over bear with me y'all i've got lots of things going on here hopefully my battery doesn't die let me just unplug all of this stuff here so i have a clear space close this as I was propping my my uh, phone on that um, so this opens up so perfectly I guess uh, let's see here this thing has a lock mechanism maybe I don't want to break it um, hold on y'all this is gonna be very challenging for me I, I'm gonna have to open it th this up and prop you guys here because I don't want to break this Okay, so I guess there's a lock mechanism here and you're supposed to like, I don't know. Goodness gracious, should I read the instructions? Dare I? Okay, there. So I'm lifting this up. Um, let's read the instructions. <laughs> All right, it says here, um, how to open it. First time users, gently move the arm from side to side from the store socket. Connect the arm into the use socket. Extend the arm. 
Uh, do not forcefully pull upward on the arm while horizontally attached to the base. I have no idea what that meant. Oh, okay. So <laughs> this thing, you just disconnect it. This triangle thing right here, because it was not swerving. <laughs> so this little thing here, as you can see, there's a triangle. You're just going to lift that up okay because it's kind of like a little puzzle then you prop it up to the way it's supposed to be like what you want it to be i guess oh for goodness sakes oh, okay you put it on the other side so this side is laying down you pop it out and then you put it on the other side and it goes straight up like so did you see that so the triangles you have to lay it down on this side and then prop it up see the triangles matches so you have to put that in there for it to stand up right angle 90 degrees okay so now for goodness sakes sorry i'm gonna have to move you guys around okay same thing with this maybe i'm not sure Okay, no, you can just pivot this and it'll turn. Okay, and then you can pivot this one on the top. I'm gonna bring this down. Pivot this one on the top so it will turn. Ooh, 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 this is kind of, ooh, I don't wanna forcefully, like it says, do not force. Okay, so this goes the opposite way towards you. Oh my goodness, make sure that the cords are not locked in like that. So there you go. Okay, so this one goes the opposite way and then it locks down. So you cannot make it go any more than that. That just locks down like so at a almost like a 90 degree angle. So now let's prop it up the right way. And basically that's what it looks like, okay. So what I want to do is I want to lay it on this blue part here. So let's unravel this. And this is the, um, the board that it comes with so that you can draw on this little board here. So it fits perfectly on my worky station here. And it's just a rectangle, okay? You can use this, you don't have to use it, but I'm feeling that I have to use it because basically this is uh, very shiny and the light will probably cast a glare onto my computer. So let's turn on my computer and, okay, let's turn on my computer. Oops, I don't even know what the password is. <laughs> okay. Let's turn on my computer and get started with this thing. Oh, I don't even know what my password is. What did I change it to? Oh my gosh. Okay, finally got it. Okay, now, uh, let me close with all the personal information here. Da, 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 da. Okay, so let's plug it in. Okay, I'm gonna have to move you guys again, sorry. Let's plug in the USB. Do I need a light? I think so. Okay. It comes with this little rubber rubber band, and that's perfect. I love that, that it's compact. Okay, so then I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. Maybe I'll plug it into the other side because right here there's a USB plug-in, but uh, basically I don't want to use that. Plug it in here. I hope it's plug and play. And I hope it's powered by the USB. Okay, so it is on. I don't know, because I didn't read the directions. It's looking like this This is the zoom button, and there's basically um, all kinds of cool things right here. Is this another, is this where you could put in a light? Oh my gosh, I just un un unlatched it. Hello. Uh, let's read the instructions again. Okay, so in order for you to turn this on, the power button is located 
bear with me here. Okay, the power button is... Click the settings icon on the top right hand corner and it works with everything. So, uh, let's see. Um, when using your third party application, you're seeing mirrored video. Don't worry, your OK cam is not faulty. Okay, click the settings on the icon of the right hand corner. Video, select OK cam from the camera drop down menu. Okay. Um, hold on. Let's see what's going on here. So I got to go into the camera section and see what's going on. Okay. There is no camera section. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Don't know. Let's read it again. Okay. Um, attach the USB cable to connect your OKCam and USB to your computer. Okay. It's completely plug and play. There's no need to install any drivers. You'll need to use an app with your OKCam. You can use it with any third party, Zoom and Google Meet. Okay, so let's just... Let's just open up Zoom because basically it, it says it allows you to like pick what kind of camera, right? So um, here I am. Okay, computer audio. Um, share the screen. And it just says here. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. I put iPad. Okay, there is no there is no other choice here. Hold on. Um Hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure. I can't tell you. I mean, it says it's not plug and play. Maybe I'm not doing doing it right. Uh Okay, Cam. All right. So, so sorry. Right here where it says on your, um, on your Zoom, hello, you're going to choose Okay, Cam. Okay. And then it's going to light up. And then basically there's going to be a white light that's just going to display. And then you're going to basically see everything on my Okay, Cam. Yes, this is awesome. Oh, wow. Look how, wow, this is great. And so you can do like, okay, so I'm pressing the buttons here. Okay. And I guess, um, you can do like with the gray button, that's like a focus, like a focus. Okay, good. And then this one is not sure i guess there's an app okay this one is of basically it will um lighten and darken your screen this one also lightens it up this and darkens it okay this one i don't know this is a blue button right here okay this one just sort of switches the camera view Okay, so then I'm, I'm thinking, you know, I don't want it to be that, that angle. So I'm going to move my camera. This is cool. You guys, this is awesome. Okay, I'm going to move my camera so that you can move your camera this way and that way. And that's great. That's great. I love it. Okay, put you back up here. Um, what else? So if I want it this way and I want to flip it. Oh wait, flip it with this side button here. That's perfect. Wow, you guys, this is awesome. I love it. It is It is so perfect. It is so, so crisp and so cool that you can see whatever I'm writing here. Okay, so I totally approve this. This is great. 
and this is so compact. I can fold it up. Let's see how it looks when you fold it back up. So just unplug it. Okay. Whoops. Okay. Unplug it and let's fold it back up. You know what to do. Take it out from the triangle and fold it up the way it's supposed to go. This does not pop off, so you're going to have to make sure that it is, you know, nice, nicely coiled up. And then um, just basically, you know, like the way I'm going to do it. I'm probably just going to do it like this. And then fold this one up. And voila! Put this back in the triangle the way you're supposed to do it, right? Like this, right? And then I have a little compartment here in my worky station. And wow, that fits perfectly. That is great. And there it goes. You, you guys, that is awesome. I really love this. So A plus on the Oki, Oki Lab with the worky station. All right, all right, that was my review. I really loved it. I'm gonna get another um, worky station, make sure that this is not hot, and I'm done for the day. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.